Hi guys and welcome back. As you know, I like doing product reviews and I also like to keep you guys updated on some of the products that I purchase. So if you've watched the video before when I purchased these tires, they are for uh, computer chairs, office chairs. Um, I will link that video if you did not get to see the review on these wheels. I ordered these off of Amazon and at the time they were great. I wanted something that was going to protect our hardwood floor or laminate floor. Something that didn't make a lot of noise either because it has these soft plastic wheels. Now these tires were great at the time. I think I had them for almost a couple years. Um, I used them every single day. They were working great. Uh, they were meant for they were meant for some weight. So I can't remember the weight amount, but you might I might have said it in the other video. Uh, the first video product review that I did about these tires. Um, anyways, over time with the rolling around, the, as you can see there's five tires with the rolling around in the chair. I will show you right here. These ones that do roll around, they are still quite nice, but when you sit into them, they squeak. Have over time, they've kind of bent. I am not the lightest person. If you're a skinny and light person, it may not have that type of problem. If you can see the tire right here, I'll show you. It is kind of bent. So, yeah, that's not very good. So I think at one point it probably gripped the floor a certain way and bent it. So now when it comes to rotating in this chair, you get a constantly squeaking noise and it's not easy to move around. I think there's a couple of them that are bent. I'm not sure which ones they were, but the one here, this one? Yeah, this one for sure was bent and a couple other ones are starting to get bent. I'm not going to throw these out. I mean, I could always use them for backups. I'm not saying they're all bad, but definitely a couple of them got flawed. So, yeah, that's not good because it should be like this where it's centered. So, I don't know. We will see how these ones hold up. So it doesn't make a sound when you just roll it around without sitting on it. Well, maybe it does. <laughs> okay, so let me sit down. There we go. That's what I mean. When you try to shift back and forth from your deck. Yeah. That's not the greatest. The only other bad thing about having these higher tires on your chair is your feet and your knees aren't really straight out. So I always have to have something under my feet just to keep my legs a little bit more level. Otherwise my feet do swell. It's not proper position for sitting. I know you can get those boards or whatever they're called to put underneath your feet. I just don't have one of those yet. So I've been using this back roller it's like a massage thing, or if you're like working out or something. So I usually just put this under my feet and it keeps my knees a little bit more, my legs a little bit more at square. Just because these tires, the tires on the chair, it brings it up more. Plus I have shorter legs. So yeah, just FYI. One of the wheels came like they, they started turning. So I don't know if the ball bearing inside let go. And you can also see that over time hair and dirt has collected inside. Now one of these, let's see, I think it's this one right here. So you can see that it over time wore out and broke. Which makes your tire not straight anymore. So for rolling around got kind of difficult. And every time I wanted to move... It was hard to move and I would get this huge squealing noise. So I just wanted to let you know that this one tire did fail. 
Now, if you are a heavier person, um, just be careful buying these because they don't stand up to the weight that they said. Um, there are tires out there that can go up to around 600 pounds uh, if you are a bigger person. Um, smaller people, lighter people, it may work better for you. But uh, yeah, I just want to update you guys and let you know that this did not hold up over time. So I think with the turning of, you know, the turning of the chair and the wheel and maybe just, yeah, it just uh, let go over time. So I'm not saying they're bad tires, bad wheels, but I just want to let you know what happened. I'll play a little bit of the footage of that chair squeaking and I'll also let you guys know of the new tires that I purchased for the chair. Again, I can't remember how much weight was supposed to be for these tires, but it was enough for me anyways and it still didn't really hold up very well. The other tires are okay kind of as they hadn't they didn't have the like the same problem. So maybe it was just a flaw in the one tire, but I'm going to hang on to these anyways because they are good backups if I happen to have like another blowout. Um, it happens. Sometimes products break down, but I did get a good year, year and a half, almost two years out of these. So just FYI, that's what happened with these tires. All right, well, thanks for joining. Um, stick around if you'd like to see more. Remember to subscribe and click the like button if you liked this updated information about these tires. All right, thanks, guys. We'll see you later. Bye.